If you want to buy cheap and reliable Ultimate Team FIFA coins, then go to fifacoinszone.com. What's up guys, I'm Tom LFC Evan and welcome to a brand new Liverpool Carrier Mode episode and comment of the day goes to Carrie Lee Hempenstahl who left these amazing comments um, to on my channel that he's so happy he found my YouTube channel and he subscribes I don't have 100k happy Easter to you as well and guys just let just share my videos with your friends and let's get to 100k together and also shout out to these guys Manolis Botsetos one Angelo Elian and Afrojack Gamer who left these amazing comments on a, recently on of my videos and iGaming in HD left this nice rhyme <laughs> on one of my Liverpool Carrier with episodes lately so shout out to him as well and Mason Williams I'm so happy that you guys are enjoying this series and my videos Will Grantated um, left this brilliant comment uh, and I'm so happy that you guys appreciate the passion and the work that goes into the making these videos. Shout out to Stefano Galebe and David Andre for all these amazing comments. So just read them, they are on the screen. And now let's you guys should enjoy today's episode. It's a cracking one. Here we go. As you can see, we are one point clear at the top of the league. And we are playing Blackburn Rovers, a newly promoted team at home so i shuffled the side a little bit uh, shakiri malanda and raheem sterling comes back into the side and after this game we will play in the league cup last 16 so these this is a great chance for many of the players the fringe players to showcase their talent let's go guys this is Anfield guys and it's raining again but we go again against Blackburn Rovers and last night I watched the, the Atletico Madrid Chelsea Champions League semi-final and it was one of the most boring, most of awful game I've ever seen. Uh, of course I don't wish injury on anybody but from a Liverpool point of view it was great to see that Petr Cech dislocated his shoulder and uh, John Terry rolled his ankle, so they are both out for the season, but at least out for the Liverpool game. So, and uh, uh, Mourinho said that they will, he would play um, a second uh, string team if it, it was up for him in the Liverpool game. But don't fool yourself, guys. He could be doing a Ferguson and just fooling us, and he might go all out uh, with his be best possible team. But of course, it's great news that uh, two of the best uh, defensive players for Chelsea, the goalkeeper and their best centre-back, is out for the Anfield game. So I think if we attack them from the off, we will surely win the game. And I think if we win the Chelsea game, we are almost there, guys, because then we only need uh, four points from the last two games. And also, I think Man City will drop points in either the Crystal Palace or either the Everton game away. And they, they have uh, two games after the Chelsea game until Liverpool play next, uh, Man City are going to Crystal Palace and to Everton. And their, their away form is, uh, is not the best. I think they can drop points against Crystal Palace and or Everton. So the, the league season is going to be exciting. Who have dreamt of this season, guys? We are close to a league title. The Anfield uh, expansion, the, the uh, extension of the stadium, we go ahead now. And uh, justice finally is near for the Hillsborough 96 victims. So what a dream season for, for Liverpool and for Liverpool fans. I'm so, so happy. And now let's beat Blackburn. Let's go. Offside. What a save, Mustafa. Oh my God. What a chance for Blackburn. They have two good chances in the couple of minutes. Raheem Sterling! Yes! <laughs> Raheem, little Raheem! Oh, love. look at that through ball from Balotelli and Raheem Sterling finishes his dinner clinically 
that's why I put him in the team. What a finish. Take a bow. Brilliant through ball from Balotelli as well. And Sterling. Cat in. I will rotate the wingers, guys, all the time. So I will I will play Suso, Shakiri, Sterling, Coutinho, Hesse, Rodriguez, Royce. We have six wingers at the team and they are all world class now. Brilliant. No way, man. Oh my god, he just runs through like, oh, like hot knife through butter. Damn it. Whip it in. Balotelli! How? How do you save that? Oh no. Come on, Sako, 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 Sako. Yes, 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 yes. We are back in the lead. Mamadou Sako, the captain, with a brilliant header from the Suarez corner. Got him, guys! I really want to beat Blackburn and stay top of the league. Great header, and the player on the line can't kick it out. Got him, guys! Sako is such a threat from corners. Brilliant! Sturridge! Oh no! What a goal that would have been! What oh, Sturridge, you should have hit the target at least. Sturridge takes it on the chest and bang! I really expected that to hit the target at least. Whoa, what the fuck was that? What on earth? What happened? What is going on in this game? Oh my word, EA sort it out. Balotelli! Oh my! Balo! How did you miss the target there? Come on! Suarez! Ah, never. Ah, come on! We have so many chances. We don't need that third goal. Ref! That's a penalty! Yes! Get him! Finally, we got a penalty this season. This will be our fir first penalty of the of the season. And uh, Malanda was just pushed off the ball, as you can see. Really clumsy, clumsy challenge. And uh, I I'm not sure who should take the penalty. Balotelli has the best penalty. I think I will give it to Balotelli because, you know, he needs a goal to up his confidence. Let's go, Balo. No! No way, man! Must finish, Sturridge. Come on! No! Ah, oh, Raheem scores the third goal, but it's offside. How close was that? Ah, oh, no, that's... Oh, my days. No way. We just can't get the third goal. I'm worried. Position are doing their best to ruin the day. I mean, the natural instinct is to... He's in a goal! What a chance! Oh my god. Oh my. Wow. Oh, why can't I get the third goal and then they almost score? Oh my fucking hell, oh, man. I'm taking off Balotelli. Oh, why did I miss the penalty with him? That won't give his confidence a boost. Oh, let's make three subs. Marcia Royce coming on and Suso as well. Let's see how the game. Royce! Are you kidding me? Wow. Oh, what a relief. We won the game, but only just. I couldn't get that third goal. The Blackburn goalie saved everything. Even a penalty from Balotelli. This is so annoying. Ah, oh, damn it. But still, the three points are the most important. But this was a frustrating game. As you can see, I had seven shots on target, but only managed to get two goals. I really need to work on my finishing. So guys, this is how the league table looks like. Tottenham won their game as well, so our lead is still only one point. And I need to sco start scoring more goals. Man United, Chelsea, Arsenal and Man City make up the top six. So the top six are already uh, pulling away from a pack. And last season, Newcastle finished third. And now they are only uh, better... Uh, they are in the, almost in the relegation zone. Only out of the relegation zone by goal difference. So what a turnaround for Newcastle. 
And uh, we are off to play Aston Villa, as you can see, in the League Cup last 16. And this will be my team. So a lot of fringe players come in and I also put Butland into the goal to see how good he is. He has 82 reflexes, so I hope we can do the job. Um, that's what the League Cup is there for, you know, guys, to play the fringe players. So let's hope they can do uh, us good and uh, advance to the next round, to the quarterfinals. Let's go, guys. Welcome to the Cock Cup, the Capital One Cup, last 16 game. Aston Villa against Liverpool. I really hope that we can get into the quarterfinals. There are some big teams left in the competition like Arsenal, Man City, Everton, Chelsea and of course us Liverpool. So hopefully we can go into the quarterfinals. Let's go guys. Come on, wisdom, 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 yes! Oh, wisdom, Andre, wisdom! The centre-back, oh, what a start, guys! He gets us the goal straight away and then he does a little bit of a samba dance. He's brilliant, that's a brilliant header. Goalkeeper can't even move. What a start, guys! Third minute and it's already a goal. Get in! And nothing. No, 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 no. Oh, my God! Are you kidding me? Oh no! I, c I couldn't! Oh no! I couldn't defend that! Fuck! Ah, oh, that was brilliant passing by Aston Villa, I have to admit, but it's so annoying. I tried everything, I tried sliding in. Oh, and they just. Wow, man! They just passed me, oh, passed me off the pitch. Butland gets a touch to it, but he couldn't save it. Oh, this will be a long 90 minutes. Open. Oh, what a block! What a block, Anderson! Come on, Marcia must finish! No way! How did he save that? Ochoa! Ah, this is a frustrating cup tie. We need that second goal. What a save! Wisdom again! Oh my God! Wisdom's heading, look at that, that's amazing. Andre Wisdom, what a picture good header that is. Pick that out, goalkeeper, look at that, top corner. Perfect header, you, you don't get to, to see a better header than that, look at that. Top corner, pick that out, goalie, see you later. Andre Wisdom comes up with two big, big headers in the first half. Oh, and let oh, he teaches the <laughs> sit down. Let me teach you how to hit the ball in the top corner. Wow, wisdom, take a bow. I'm so happy I kept him. He's now an 82 rated right back, but he can play center back. And this heading is wow, he's amazing in this game. Royce, oh my, how did you not hit the target there, Royce? Come on. So so what a run! Oh my god! Oh so so he came back from the short loan. He came back from Real Madrid and that's a cracker. Look at the goalkeeper. The ball is so powerfully struck that he can't get near it. What a run by Suso! What a finish! I really don't want him to leave because now he's an 86 rated right midfielder and his finishing is improving. Yes! 3-1, hopefully this seals the game. Look at that Suso, brilliant. No. Oh my god! Woohoo! Kozak almost, almost made it free. Oh, what a hit. I was about to tackle him with Flanagan, as you can see. But he shoots over, over only just. So we are making three subs. Uh, Corel, Liptak and Hesse Rodriguez coming on. They don't usually get a lot of playing time. So in the League Cup, I will give them some opportunities. Martial! Ooh, good save, good save. Corel! Finish it! No, man, no. Joe <laughs> Anderson chopped him down. <laughs> oh, damn it, it's a red card. 
Oh, I really wanted to stop him. I didn't want to get nervous last few minutes. Oh, Anderson, that's a really dirty tackle from behind. Oh, that's awful. Uh, Stonewall red card, no complaints. Oh! Oh, what? They hit the post! Holy... Holy cow! No, no, mate. No, mate. You can't score that as well. Wow. We got quite lucky, to be honest, because Aston Villa had the chances to score the goals. And, guys, wisdom scored two beast headers from two corners and he basically won the game and Suso scored a quite a lovely goal as well so I'm really really happy with this win and we are through to the quarterfinals of the League Cup let's see who we get in the next round guys so guys uh, this is the League Cup round 4 results Arsenal, Everton and Man City are through to the next round Man City only on penalties but the big shock, Middlesbrough knocked out Chelsea. So Chelsea won't meet us in the League Cup final again, which is a really good change. Hopefully we can get to the final and we get oh, a Merseyside derby in the quarterfinals. And we are at home, which is brilliant. Liverpool against Everton. I'm very happy with that draw. Hopefully we can smash Everton and get into the semi-finals and another good thing is the other two big teams Arsenal and Man City are drawn to each other so there were there will be two small clubs and two big clubs in the semi-finals so very very exciting times and guys there will be a Man City game in the next episode so guys if you want to see the next episode later today get this video to 200 likes it's a Man City and Benfica so two big big games thanks for watching have a nice day goodbye so let's see what the side guys wow on fifa 15 i hope they will show anfield from the aerial view as well because that's just an absolutely beautiful